Monday was great because it was a great introduction to the events of the week and we were able to interact with the guests and tell them what to expect through this, you know, whole interaction and this process between Jackson Family Wines and Canada Beef. and just get to know where they're from, why they're here, how long they've been here, you know, is this a special occasion, do they come here often, are they members, and just kind of explain and introduce Jackson family to, you know, the people of Charisma. And at the end of the day, it's just a beverage, and it's a meal that you're enjoying with family and friends, and I think that you should eat what you want to eat and drink what you want to drink. So I think that some white wine may be better paired with certain dishes, and some red wines may be better paired with other dishes. But I think if you are drinking what you like to drink, and then you're eating a, a, a food or a dish that, that's enjoyable to you, then the whole experience is going to be better than if you know, you're focused so much on the rules. It's, it's about it's about the experience. I think when you talk about partnerships between kind of really authentic companies that have a really good sense of place and a sense of region and a sense of quality. There's no question that Jackson Family and Canada Beef and Charisma all embody all of those qualities and those visions and what they're trying to portray. So I think it was a natural partnership. Um, I don't think there could be a better one. Uh, so it's, you know. It's been really fun. I think my favorite thing was meeting the guests you know, being able to interact with him and share my passion for wine and Sonoma County where I live and Jackson Family Wines, you know, what they do in their everyday life and exchange contact information. And a lot of people said, I want to know where to buy your wines and, you know, how can I get Hartford? How can I get La Crema where I live? You know, when are you coming back? Like, I want to schedule my next trip down to El Dorado to, like, people want a sense of place, they feel home here. When they walk into the, to the resort, people say, you know, they're greeted with, welcome home. And that's how people feel. And so I feel like with this series, people are gonna feel that exact same way. I mean, it's been a week long of like really very fun, authentic events, kind of each one preparing me to what's gonna happen tonight. So, you know, I came Monday to, uh, you know, get a little bit of taste how Fuentes worked and how, you know, the interaction between the chef and, and things like that happened. But, um, I mean, also, I met so many great people throughout the week uh, that just guests that had come to various events and so I saw them all here and was able to kind of ask them the rest, you know, their experiences for throughout the rest of their week and what their favorite dishes were and kind of met a lot of friends. So tonight's been really fun.